we introduce Eagle Body, a large-scale dataset for egocentric 3D human body shape and motions of interacting people in complex 3D things. To understand human behaviors during social interactions, a first step is to estimate 3D human shape and pose of a social partner, here referred as the interactee, from visual inputs, especially from the egocentric view. However, research in this area is severely hindered by lack of data. Most existing datasets only provide third-person view images, losing important visual cues. On the other hand, existing egocentric view datasets are limited in either social interaction diversities or annotation modalities. To fill this gap, we propose EgoBody, a large-scale egocentric dataset for 3D human motions during social interactions in complex 3D things, with multiple synchronized data modalities for both the egocentric and the third-person view. Furthermore, we provide accurate 3D human shape and motion annotations in the reconstructed 3D things with eye gaze tracking from HoloLens 2. To encourage rich body motions, we define social interaction scenarios given a classification from sociology studies spanning diverse action types. The dataset includes 125 sequences with 36 subjects in multiple 3D indoor scenes. The dataset is captured with state-of-the-art hardware. Given two interacting subjects in the indoor environments, we ask one subject to wear a HoloLens 2 headset and capture the first-person view images of the second person. Meanwhile, the HoloLens also tracks eye gaze of the camera wearer. Three Azure Kinex capture the interactions from multiple third-person views. Given the multi-view RGBD videos and the HoloLens images, we reconstruct the 3D full body shape and motions for both interacting subjects. We leverage Eagle Body to introduce the first benchmark for 3D human pose and shape estimation from egocentric view images. The performance of state-of-the-art 3D human pose and shape estimation methods start to saturate on existing major datasets with third-person view images such as 3DPW. However, most of them show a significant accuracy drop to different extents when it tested on our dataset. The poor generalization of existing methods shows new challenges posed by egocentric data. Due to the constant body movement and close human-to-human -human distances in social interactions, the first-person view images often exhibit challenging cases such as body truncations and motion blur. Existing methods often fail on such cases that they are not designed to handle such challenges. We carefully analyze the influence of these specific challenges on each method's performance. Here we show that the average error on a body joint tends to be higher if it's more frequently truncated from the images. Furthermore, we show that fine-tuning on our training set improves the robustness of the methods against these challenges. Quantitatively, our fine-tuned models show much higher accuracy compared to their respective original models on both pose and shape metrics. Finally, a cross-dataset evaluation validates that our training set also helps improve the model's performance on other egocentric data. After fine-tuning three recent methods, SPIN, METRO, and EFT on our training set, their post-estimation accuracy on the U2Me dataset is also significantly improved. In summary, we present EagleBody dataset, the first large-scale dataset of 3D human motions during social interactions in 3D environments from both the egocentric view and the third-person views with high-quality 3D full-body pose, shape, and motion annotations for all interacting subjects, accompanied by eye gaze tracking of the camera wearer. With this dataset, we introduce the first benchmark for 3D human pose and shape estimation from egocentric view images, reveal the limitations of existing methods, demonstrate the effectiveness of our training data, and provide insights for future work of this category. We will provide a website for the benchmark and will make the code and dataset freely available for research purposes.
Thank you for watching.